I got you. I know. Oh. <laughs> this might be one of the coolest things. Take a look at this. Good morning, everybody. Welcome to the vlog. We're back at Zoological Wildlife Foundation here in Miami. And I really wanted Lori to come down to kind of get the experience of meeting some of these animals. Not to mention, we came last time at night, so I didn't get to see the whole place. So today, we are meeting up with some of our friends, and we are going to just have an amazing time. And Lori is about to get the experience of her lifetime. It's going to be an absolutely incredible day, and I hope that you guys have a great start to your day as well. Go ahead and do me a favor and comment and let me know what you think about whatever's on your mind. And while you're down there, go ahead and smash that like button. What do you say we go inside and meet some awesome animals? One of the things I wanted to address before we even get started looking at a lot of animals is what a place like this is about. You know, some people had commented, unfortunately, and this is just gonna happen when you're in a place like this, they thought that this place might be exploiting the animals, especially the animal encounters that you have to pay for. But you gotta remember, this place costs a tremendous amount of money to run. They have to bring in contributions, and one of the ways you can do that is to get encounters. And there's very few places in this country, certainly, that you can get the type of access to animals that they have. So yes, they do charge for encounters. The truth is that just keeps things going. I've known Mario for a long time and I can promise you that this isn't about the money for him. I mean, to be honest with you, a place like this costs so much to run that he can just barely make enough money to pay the bills around here. So he's not putting a bunch of money. This is far from some kind of animal mill just to produce animals for profit and so on like that. These places really give you an opportunity to get up and close to animals and really start appreciating it. So I just wanted to address that before we even get started. This might be one of the coolest things. Take oh a look at goodness. this. Guys, meet Limbani. <laughs> this is the little chimp. Look at how cute he is and he loves you. Oh my God, this is crazy. Oh my gosh, <laughs> he is so, look at his ears and his face. Oh my gosh, Limbani is amazing. And you know, they always say, I've seen a couple chimps relatively closely, but this is the first time that I've ever like held one or been like this type of situation. And they always say that when you get that opportunity, opportunity with the chimp that it is you realize how close to humans they are I mean look at him look his face expression look at him just cuddling with Lori this is crazy. <laughs> he's just holding on he is absolutely adorable there are a few chimps in the entire country that you can come in contact with so this is an unbelievable pleasure and and a day I won't ever forget I mean I'm gonna be honest with you the first day we met a chip Lori we got to take this chimp home please I don't think so. <laughs> no, she won't even let me have a little oh, chimp. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh my Let's see what this. <laughs> yeah, look at him, Bonnie. <laughs> Oh, he is so adorable. Please do me a favor and again, show Zoological Wildlife Foundation some love. I will put all the links in the description. Also, I want to give a special thanks to Mike, the real Tarzan, for, for helping us out with this. Oh my gosh, and I wanted to give a special thanks to Mario. This is Mario, he's the owner. I've known Mario on and off now for a long, long time and he is an amazing person and I can tell you that he loves these animals with all his heart as you can certainly see the bond he has with Zimbani. Do me a favor, again, go down and follow uh, ZWF Miami as well as Mario has an Instagram account. I'm gonna put all their links in the description. Uh, this guy is, I mean, he's a hero to me. So thank you, Mario, for letting thank us come out. It's awesome. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Them, Bonnie. Oh, I'm dying right now. Oh. oh my gosh, guys, look at this. These are little three week old jaguars. There's a male and a female. Look at how adorable. Now, I know you're going to love these ones, Laura. Yeah, now this is going to be hard not to take home because they're so cute. <laughs> look at how cute they are. Oh my gosh, look at that little face. <laughs> are you ready to no, well, yes. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be honest with you, this is the experience that I really was excited for. I could just bring one out. No, 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 no we'll it. try this. If I'm gonna die, this is the way to go, right? Exactly. exactly. Holy f***, that hurt. <laughs> All right, I am not meat. <laughs> I know. See, I, I got you. I got you. And I know. Oh, Yeah. Okay. Okay, we're calm now, guys. We're calm now. We're calm now. Are you okay? Are you okay? We're calm now. <laughs> yeah, he is. <laughs> okay. What I do to you? <laughs> I see you. <laughs> Uh, All right. <laughs> These guys don't bite as hard. 
Ten four. I'm like Burnsy here. You're right. I oh. see you. <laughs> 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 I know you, buddy. I know you. I know all about you. I know you. I know you. Oh. <laughs> all right. <laughs> all right. <laughs> I know. All right. It's really cool, but they definitely are at the point to where it's a little crazy. <laughs> They're more than kittens. <laughs> Hey, bud. For some reason, the tiger wants some of them. Hi, silly. No. He got me, though. You little silly. You are something else, you little silly. He's the one you gotta keep an eye on. Yeah. Feel more so away. Yeah. Oh my goodness, yeah. I'll scratch you. I'll scratch you. I'll scratch your belly. Yeah. I see what you're doing. You're like sneaking up like, oh, I'm not going to do anything. And then you're like, ah, oh, get your... Amazing. Oh my God, they're huge. I got it. They're huge. Look at that. Yeah, look at that. Look at those claws. Oh my goodness. They're so huge. You ain't got nothing on Zeus's paws. You're so funny. <laughs> you chica. You chica, you. What Tiger's you angry as hell. <laughs> you got a little bite there. You got a good bite yes, over there. Yes, I did. That's what I said. I got a Bernsey bite here. <laughs> <laughs> Aren't they awesome, though? <laughs> yeah, they're pretty cool. But uh, definitely some wild animals. You're so cheeky. These guys are so smart because they really want the camera. Again, we have a little fuzzy thing on top and they just think it's awesome. And so they'll like literally like pretend like they're not looking and kind of walk around you and I jump it. <laughs> I mean, it's so funny how they think. I mean, that's what makes them such great predators. No. See how he's like, oh, I'm not gonna go after it. <laughs> I'm not gonna go after it. You can play with them now. Oh, oh. <laughs> Come on, come on, bud. Come on, bud. All right. What was my pants? <laughs> you got her, didn't you? Didn't you? Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, you sillies. All right. Nope. nope. You got it. <laughs> You gotta watch the tiger. <laughs> oh my gosh, you are so funny. I'm thinking they're real cool, but they could definitely stay here. <laughs> I thought for sure she'd be like, we need to bring these home, but yeah, I think now she's nope, kind of like, no. <laughs> Lori, what did you think? Was it cool? I mean, it's a cool experience, right? It was a cool experience, but these are legit no joke. Like, it's not a cat, it's not a kitten, it's not even a dog. This is like a little wild animal that wants to play and it ain't no joke, as my leg will tell you. <laughs> yeah, we got, we're bloodied. I had a big old... Yeah. I mean, that, how cool is that? That Think tiger latched on like it was a piece of meat. And I was like, wait a second, this is attached to my leg. No. <laughs> I mean, how cool is that? You got like attacked by a tiger. I mean, that yeah. is freaking awesome. I mean, I, I mean, I'm not going to lie. I'm not mad that I'm going to have a cool scar. Like, yeah, I got that from tiger. No, I'm not big. <laughs> that, that was freaking epic. And that's exactly why I wanted to bring Lori in. Is I wanted to, to get me bit by a tiger. I wanted her to experience it because I think that's the most cool. That's just the coolest thing on the planet. Just want to take a second before we move on to the next thing to say number one normal public doesn't get in with the lions and tigers like that they're just too big uh, they do occasionally bring them out for like one at a time like a photo op but you're not playing with them and as a matter of fact they are now at that stage where the keepers will actually stop them from playing with people like they don't want a tiger or a lion that's you know hundreds of pounds to be playing with people because as you guys saw even playing can really hurt I mean I've got all kinds of bite marks all over me but the fact is is that you know places like this although there's interactions with animals animals like these lions and tigers you know again you know I know there's a fine line between exploitation and so like that but I really believe that Zoological Wildlife Foundation is here to really educate people and to get people excited about conservation and, and, and they talk a lot about the, the plight of these animals it's really a great organization and I'm not saying that there aren't places like this that are bad I'm just saying that I know this place is really good so I know some of you are concerned and you've commented a couple things on my previous video and I just want to make sure you guys understand that uh, yeah 
yes, if you're gonna support a place like this with contributions, which I encourage you to go, again, link is in the description, and try to contribute and, and support places like this. But make sure you know what the places are. There's bad places, you don't wanna give them money either, uh, but I can assure you that Zoological Wildlife Foundation isn't one of those places, and it's just an amazing experience. <laughs> Yeah, probably not the wisest choice of parents. Nothing <laughs> <laughs> oh, <geez. laughs> to camera. Oh, oh my god! <laughs> <laughs> what do you think? Lauren? Oh my god, this is insane. <laughs> <laughs> oh. They really, really like your camera, though. <laughs> <laughs> Memory card out. <laughs> Yes, every every thought I had about monkeys is true. <laughs> They're freaking crazy. <laughs> oh my god. Hey bud. <laughs> I just have to be on guard. They just fly out everywhere. <laughs> oh. Shit. oh. This is, this, is, this is absolutely, this is absolutely so much freaking fun, man. Well, he's um, getting stuff out of your pocket. He's <laughs> coming, yeah, just like the movies. <laughs> oh my gosh. I, these are the true definition of cheeky monkey for oh sure. My oh, oh my goodness. <laughs> oh my god. Hi. Hi, bud. Hi. Oh, you're going after my phone. Yeah, you little thief. We choose to go to the moon. Oh my god. How fun. Hey, you be nice, Mom. Oh my god. Straight crazy. Of course, what we have here, guys, is a cage full of capuchins. I mean, look at this. It's crazy. <laughs> Hi, guys. Hi, guys. Hi, guys. Hi. 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 How are you, pretty? Hi, pretty. Of course, guys, these are the lesser anteaters, the camaduas. Uh, they are absolutely incredible. Look at the big old claws on that little guy right there. Yeah. You definitely don't want to get They're ripped up by those them. guys. What do you think, Laura? Is that cool or what? Yeah, these are really neat. <laughs> they are so pretty. And the thing that, again, you don't have to worry about them biting because they don't have teeth. They have really long tongues. Look at that. But boy, you've got to worry about those claws a little bit. But they're not aggressive, so uh, I'm sure that you don't have any problems. But man, that is amazing. And again, in the wild, these guys are exclusively really ant eaters, and they'll just eat thousands and thousands of ants a day, which is amazing. I mean, you can imagine an animal even this size uh, being completely sustained on something as small as an ant. Hi, bud. Hi, sweetheart. Oh yeah, look at that tongue. <laughs> look at how fast. <laughs> oh my god, that's hilarious. <laughs> Do you see that? <laughs> and that's not even fast motion. <laughs> Some scary claws there. Oh my gosh. Whoopsie, I know. <laughs> no, you're not gonna get those. Sloths are so crazy because they they really are like slow motion. This is like the it's just like Ice Age. I tell you what, it's like super slow motion. These guys are crazy. <laughs> Hi. <laughs> I love sloths, man. I tell you what, that is just freaking insane. This is the best day ever. Hey, what's going on? You gonna come out and get some food? You gonna come out and get some food? Look at him. Come on, bud. Come on. Come on. Come on. 
reminds me of Zeus with a super stretch nose. <laughs> Come on. Come on. <laughs> wow. That kiss ain't good. So cool. <laughs> so freaking weird. <laughs> These are the giant anteaters here, of course. So, oh my gosh, look at how gorgeous that animal is. I mean, it is absolutely incredible. And <laughs> what do you think, Laurie? Yeah, that's it's very cool. <laughs> yeah, me and my yogurt bath. Nice. <laughs> Thanks. <laughs> Thanks a lot. <laughs> you know, again, one of those times where you just got to question Mother Nature and think, like, what was that all about? You know, I mean, this thing is crazy cool. Oh my gosh. It's actually super soft, and he seems very sweet. And he doesn't stink yet. <laughs> yeah, yeah, but it's it's nothing like the skunk spray. His face is so cute. So Lori, can I have a, a skunk? Uh, no. Oh my god. Why? We don't need a skunk. How can you say that we don't need a skunk? That's those words don't even match. I don't need to take care of a skunk. How's that? I'll take care of it. We all know how that goes. Look at how cute he is. Look how he cute the little skunker cute. is. Very loving. So that means I can have him. Awesome. Shut up. <laughs> you are so cool. Oh my goodness. Yeah. This is pretty neat. Cool? Yeah, this is super cool. Oh, is it worth the trip? I wanted you to come down. I just wanted you to experience this. I mean, isn't this place <laughs> magical? This is a really cool place. Cooler than I ever could have imagined. And yeah, I would say it's definitely worth the drive. Oh my gosh, it's awesome. <laughs> so you guys absolutely not only got to show them some love, but certainly if you're ever in the area, you got to come and check this oh, place Oh yeah, out. like this is an awesome experience. You want any kind of animal adventure or get really cool interactions, this place is amazing. It really is. And the animals are cared for beyond belief. I mean, you can't find one animal here that isn't in like tip top shape, which is, uh, <laughs> you know, isn't always the case at, yeah. at private zoos. So uh, I, I can't say enough about this place. All right, guys, so we are leaving Zoological Wildlife Foundation. We actually have about uh, four hours to get to Orlando and our flight leaves pretty soon. We did hang out a little bit later than what I wanted it to. So uh, we're gonna be a little bit stressed, but hopefully we'll get to the airport and not miss our flight. Okay, so we made it back to the airport. Uh, I think we have enough time to get to security. I hope so. <laughs> and hopefully we'll make our flight and hopefully we'll be home just like this. And I'm home finally. It is amazing to be home after being gone for close to a week. It's always cool to come back and see my family, my puppies, and tomorrow I get to go see my animals. I hope that you guys enjoyed this journey down to Florida. Let me know what you guys think down in the comments. What was your favorite part? What do you want me to do next? And do you like these type of adventures or do you like me back at the shop? Or do you want a little both? Regardless, I hope that you guys have an amazing day. Thank you so much for tuning in. You guys mean the world to me and I love you so much. Can you do me a couple favors before we leave today? Can you smash that like button and turn those post notifications on so you know when I upload a video, which is every day, seven days a week at nine o'clock in the morning, Eastern Standard Time. Make sure to be kind to somebody and I promise I'm gonna see you guys tomorrow.